Hey, this is John with Six Ring Country, and we're going to learn a song, Hank, by Whiskey Myers. Hank is in C-sharp and was written by Cody Cannon and Dave Bahanish. The song features a cool doubled guitar riff that will do both on the acoustic and the electric. There is a simple chord progression if you don't want to learn that riff on the rhythm guitar, but there is a cool guitar solo in the middle as well, as well as some tasty licks. So let's get started. lesson, I'm going to be playing my acoustic guitar here. The song's in C-sharp, and we're going to play some riffs on this acoustic. Um, this might not be the best song if you're looking for a simple strum. Um, there's a simple strum pattern, but there's a lot of riffs, so this might not be your song if, if you're looking to just kind of learn some chords and play along. Um, there certainly is room to, to skip out on some of these riffs, and I'll show you how to do that. Um, the strum pattern is easy as a whole, but... Um, if you want to really contribute in the song, it needs you to play some of these riffs on the acoustic. Um, but let's just go ahead and get started. This intro riff, you are going to kind of ping pong a riff with the lead guitar. It's going to start out here. You just repeat it. So that's the, that's the main theme lick, and you play that every time with the electric guitar. The electric guitar is going to play it further down the neck with some more open strings. Um, but if you listen to the original recording, these guys, it's, it's a pretty, um, it's a super cool riff that both electric guitars are doing that if you're playing just acoustic, you want to help out some way. So it's the fourth fret G string. I'm going to hammer on to the sixth fret G string. And we're gonna go straight into a pre-chorus, and this is where everything starts to pick up. You're gonna do a big E chord there, a refresh on that is open E, second fret A, second fret D, first fret G, open B and E strings. Back to that F sharp chord we're doing. And hit that C sharp five. And we're gonna do a riff there. This is, an, this is actually doubled of what the lead guitar is doing. So. So that riff, um, don't be intimidated by that riff. Um, it's, a, it's supposed to be pretty dramatic in that big walk down. Um, fourth fret E string up to the seventh fret E string. And then hammering. Let's put all this to tempo. Here is the intro, outro, and that main lick. One, two, three, four. Here is both verse one and verse two. Two, three, four. Okay, so for the lead guitar, I'm playing my 335 here, 
I'm using the bridge pickup and I have kind of a medium overdrive. I'm using a stomp box pedal. So there's a lot of amp volume. The amp is cranked and there's an overdrive pedal on there. And it's set to about medium. I have my amp reverb about low and there's a compression pedal on there as well. So it's giving you... I'm really covering two electric guitars here. Um, Whiskey Myers loves that double electric um, and a lot of them double their riffs, so it's a huge sound. Um, the acoustic guitar will help you out on some of these riffs, but for the most part, I wanted a meaty, beefy sound, so that's what we're coming with. Um, and the amp is modeled after a Fender Bassman, so um, if you're trying to dial in tones on a modeler, that's, that's where I'm, I'm headed. Um, let's go ahead and get started. So the song is really gonna be hanging out in, in the C minor, um, uh, C sharp, C sharp minor, C sharp A string. And then we're gonna climb down from the fourth fret to the second fret, the D string to the A string. And then we're gonna do a chromatic walk down, four, three, two, open, and then hit an E chord. So that's the pre-chorus. Um, I'll play that one more time slowly, starting on that big E bar, big E open chord. F sharp to the C sharp. D diamond and then diamond on the F sharp. So coming off that riff, every pre-chorus does this. It's gonna do a big hit on the E, a big hit on the F sharp, and then you're gonna hit the, um, the C sharp, and then we're right into that chorus. Um, so let's take that one more time, one, Two, three, pre-chorus. Here's the riff. Um, and then you just end the song on that C sharp five. So let's put this all to tempo. Here is the intro riff. Two, three, four. 